Barcelona first time. Yobi back in there as well. And it's in. Crowd of heads went up. And Viduca is claiming another goal for Celtic. Such a difficult ball to defend. It's whipped in there from Blinker. Derek still he comes. And on reflection, he perhaps should have stayed. But it's a good delivery. There's plenty of pace on it. Viduca so much traffic in that area but he's got such a physical presence he's up he's dominating he brushes the challenges off and Andy Dow on the line just can't do enough to keep it out Jonathan Gould who's kept five clean sheets in the last seven games on by Viduca Larson has Blinker with him Reggie Blinker off the post but it's plumped in So well to win the aerial ball in the first place to knock it into the dangerous area he out jumps Gary Smith gets a great touch on it Larson puts Blinker away and Viduka following up to get on the end of the rebound off the post Larson does well here to hold off Perry knocks it in front of Blinker that's a good effort from Blinker and the way things are going at the moment no real surprise that it broke to Marco Viduka gets the first touch Larson uses his body strength delightful ball to put Blinker in couldn't have broken any more kindly for Marco Viduca than it did. In comes another cross now, and this time it's a goal for Henrik Larsson. He was not to be denied after all. It's number 34 of the season for the Super Swede, and it's 3 0. Well, he's been too quiet, hasn't he? Missed a glorious chance earlier on to get his name on the score sheet. Good ball in from Tosh McKinley, swinging away from Derek Stilly. There's plenty of power on the header. Good ball in from Tosh McKinley. And Larson gets up well. And Stilly, who had done so well just a few seconds earlier, left without a hope there. And he does get up well. He's not the tallest. His timing is exceptional. Larson. Burley, you fancy Celtic. Maybe to get a few more, and they certainly fancied at the moment. Bernie. And his Larson! It's his second of the game. Two for Viduka, two for Larson. Lethal. Beautiful delivery from Burley. That's into such a dangerous area. Derek Stiller can't really come for that. He's too deep. And Larson's in there above Gary Smith. Burley not closed down. Time to measure the cross. And Larson does exactly what he did a few moments ago. Powers the header downwards. That's a smashing header. And Winters took it away from Lambert. Still Winters goes, it's a magnificent run, and it's a superb solo strike from Robbie Winters. Well, if there is such a thing as consolation at this stage, this is it. A wonderful goal here from Winters. Runs directly at reset, and he's quick enough to get away from him. Still a lot of work to be done. McKinley slides in, and what a good finish from Robbie Winters. Comes on to his right side, Tosh McKinley can't make the challenge. And he just strokes it away from Jonathan Gould. McNamara. Virgil. Burley and Larson are in the box at the moment. Virgil's cross finds Burley! It's number five! And it's convincing yet again from Celtic. All they can do is keep winning. That's just what they're doing. Yeah, it's no bad sign either if this man is popping up in the box at this late stage in the game. Still short of fitness, but still prepared to get forward. That's not an easy one to hit first time. He's being shot down here by Gary Smith as the ball comes in. And that's a good first-time effort, pulling it away from Derek Stilley. Good ball in from Mark Burchill, but not an easy one to hit. And he made a good job of it.